And we put out a swarm a box. And I scored us some swarm commander on the entrance of this hole right here. See that? I scored us some swarm commander right there. Now we're just gonna stand back and see what happens. Hey guys. So this is about a half an hour after I put this box out, the Swarm Commander box. This is about a half hour later. Look at that. They're all worker bees. Look about every single one of these bees is loaded with pollen on its legs. They used to have bees right here. Uh, and they took them um, last night. So these are all worker bees left behind. Look, every one has pollen on it. Every bee has pollen. Okay guys, again, me and Shakar are driving around and um, we see this fence post, it's loaded up. And what we've done is we've put one frame right here, we've already filled that up, and um, look at B right there. And um, we, we filled this frame up and we stuck it in this box, I shook it off, I'm putting the frame back up for a second load, and, it, and the first frame was loaded from front to back. The back side of this frame is already loaded, and so it might take a couple more of these frames but um we have them so you can see their butts up in the air right here and they're fanning for everybody to go in that hole and so we've got some bees going this hole we've got bees there and um i i tried a couple of different ways first i stuck the box here like i shook this and there yeah that was a disaster they went they went everywhere that was a complete disaster and uh I think this is the best method. It's just used to let them crawl onto this frame here and put it in, shake it off, let them crawl on, shake it off. I only have one frame of uh, drawn comb. The rest are, are, are foundation, are useless. They don't like, they don't care for plastic. And um, so there it is. Our third swarm this year. Yeehaw! Hey guys, it is still the same day. I just changed shirts. I thought it might not be a good idea to look like a big red flower standing next to 6,000 bees. So, um, this is taking a long time. This is my third frame. It, it's taking longer for me to get on this frame. So I'm gonna shake this off. And I think I'm just gonna try to scrape them off onto the uh, um, frame and see if that makes things quicker. Get as many bees as we can out of this. Okay guys, I got them on this pulse. It's getting better. I'm, I'm throwing them right here. And uh, that seems to be the best method I've found so far. You wanna film me? I'm filming. Yeah. So what I do is I just kinda scrape them by the handfuls like this. And I just throw them right there onto the entrance. And I'm pretty much I pretty much gathered them mostly that way. Ow, ow, ow. Son of a, ow. Got stung. Did you get stung? Yeah. That hurts. Got stung right on the belly. Oh. <laughs> ow, owie, owie, owie. Okay. Right on the belly. 
That's two challenges <laughs> of one. Oh, that hurts worse than getting stung on the hand. Oh. Oh. You know, I now know why God has women have babies, not man. Uh, we cannot take pain very well. Whew, this has been an hour later. Just kidding. All right, let's go back to the bees. <laughs> it still hurts. Okay, regroup. I've now got my shirt tucked in so a bee can't come up and sting me right on the belly. You know, the part that's going to be a bummer about this is, is um, I'm a skinny guy and I got stung on the belly, which gives this appearance that I'm overweight. <laughs> that's my story and I'm sticking to it. All right, let's do it again. Ow, crap, I want to do it again. <laughs> All right, all right, here we go. Oh, I'm a little lurry now. Ah. I hate it when I do that, by the way. But look at them piling in. Yeah. Man, what? They were pinging my hat. I was dropping them on you. Oh! <laughs> I, was, I was dropping them on you. This is, hey guys, this is about two hours. All, this isn't like a swarm with the queen inside. These, these are all worker bees, field workers. Look at that. That, that's crazy. Every one of these bees here has pollen on it in its baskets there every one of these bees is loaded with pollen every single bee has pollen and it's it's amazing so and they're funneling in look at that they're funneling inside so hopefully we'll come in tonight we'll take this we'll marry it into one of our weak hives with the queen because so i know these guys don't have a queen these are just worker bees this is crazy we just got back from um catching a swarm and I got stung three times on the stomach. We counted afterwards, right, right, right there. So that's where my stomach's, look, my stomach swelled out, guys. I was, I'm like skinny guy, and look how big this swelled out. It's crazy. So we'll come back for these guys um, uh, tonight. Hey guys, Mama Dean here. So I just want to give you guys a quick, up, quick update on the goats to let you know how they're doing. Um, kind of sad but patches right there uh, she did go into labor and she ended up having some uh, complications from the labor the baby was born breech we had to call a friend to help us to uh, to try and deliver the baby we lost that little one he was a boy good size and then the little girl was born uh, she uh, we had to kind of get her breathing and everything, but we uh, we lost her today. So it was um a, a pretty low blow, pretty hard. But um, Patches is doing okay. I'm gonna milk her, get that milk and everything, and then. But uh, Bossy's babies are doing really good, right there. And then Daisy, just as funky as ever. So just wanted to hurry and let you guys know how the goats are doing and uh, and everything. So um, yeah, but guys, it's just it's part of homesteading. These things happen, and you just roll with it. Hey guys, thanks for watching, and uh, we had fun catching the swarms. It was a lot of fun. It was a pretty big adrenaline rush. It was uh, a little painful at some <laughs> at some points, but uh, we had fun doing it. Mm -hmm. uh, and uh, meanwhile. It, as soon as it gets dark, we're gonna go cap, go get that uh, swarm of bees that's on the um, uh, fence post. Mm -hmm. I don't think we'll be filming that. It'll be too dark to film. Yeah. So we'll pick up tomorrow of us uh, of what we're gonna do. Um, we're gonna combine the two hives together. That's gonna be interesting. Yeah, we've never done that before, so that, that'll be a lot of fun. And um, we will see you guys tomorrow.